what a way to start a vlog looking my best so today is actually i don't know it's tuesday i can't even remember it's like that weird time of year don't know what's going on but actually our new bed should be coming today because this one broke the other day so we ordered a new one the legs broke on it so that was nice and fun um so it's actually on the floor and it's not zesty at all so fingers crossed the new one's coming today um i think this is just gonna be a really random vlog so buckle up um yeah i need to get ready for the day because this isn't a look i need to fix out my hair i just need to um get dressed so yeah Okay, so I just finished getting ready. Actually, everyone is waiting in the car for me. We're just gonna go get some brunch, but I did want to quickly show you guys my outfit of the day. So this is my dress right here. It is super cute. And then I just have it on with my Puma Callies. This dress is from Urban Sport. And oh my God, it just fits so well and super comfy. I'm really out of breath. And it's really hot today, so yeah, I'm hopefully want to get back. There's a bed waiting. <laughs> So it's actually a couple hours later, actually not a couple, a lot of hours later. I am home now. I'm actually about to go out again. So that's why I'm in a different outfit. And I thought I would quickly show you guys what I picked up for Boxing Day during the Boxing Day sales. I was going to do a whole video what dedicated to this, but I thought I would just like chuck it in here because it's kind of like a holiday weekly vlog. And yeah, I want to show you guys what I picked up during boxing day so let's get into it so the first thing that i got actually the first place i went was cook eye i love their boxing day sales uh, every time i even talk about cook eye i always mention their boxing day sales so let's start i actually already won this one and i put it back just literally to show you guys what I got and I got a zero in all of these things I just love their basics because when they come on sale they're still just like perfect because they're just such simple basics and you can wear them with so many things so I just got this little white crop top I then got this which I've been eyeing off for so long now so I'm so happy that I got it and it was 40% off and I'm very excited to wear this. It is a bodysuit and it has a collar and just got that one in white. They had black, but they didn't have it in my size, which was pretty annoying. But if I do see it in the coming days, I will definitely be getting that. Oh, actually, I got this in the Boxing Day sales. This is from Sabo Skirt. It is a play suit. I will insert a full clip of it right now. And I got that in an extra small, so I picked that up on Boxing Day, and I think they either had 20 or 25% off store-wide, and that was so good. So this is actually the first thing I've ever bought from a Sabo skirt, and I'm pretty happy with it. I just love all their play suits, and yeah, I feel like I'm going to get a lot of good wear out of this. Then, oh, almost last, I got this cute a little, like, sage mint green top. I really love this color. Oh, actually, I think you could describe it as, like, pistachio tie detail there and love that and then this one is kind of similar just not sleeved so it's like that very cute so i think i've done really well with those ones then i went to glassons i picked up these little shorts these were in my most recent instagram photo and i'll have that here so yeah, these are super comfy. They're not really crazy see-through. So if I can actually pick these up in some other colors, they probably will, but they only had that color. Then I went to Zara and I got these pants. 
so these are so cute i got them in an extra small so they're just this beautiful like nude color here and they're really really flared flared is that the word at the bottom um i don't have any pants like this i have not one pair of like flared wide leg pants so these are a first i just thought these were really really good for when i go into meetings they're just like super cute and chic so love them the next and last clothing item that i picked up is from dis the huba i think that's how you pronounce it um and i know it is the middle of summer which is probably why this is such a good deal and it is this long line black like tweed style coat this was like how much was this this was two hundred dollars and i got it for 50 so i'm so stoked about that they actually only had it in an eight they don't go any smaller but this i literally could not have gotten any smaller i don't have anything from de Huba. i really hope i'm saying that right um but yeah this is definitely a small fit so if you see this size up and obviously you always want to size up in coats or at least i like sizing up in coats because you layer underneath them then the last thing i got was actually not on boxing day but the, the rest of everything was but i got this today and it was for their boxing day sale it was still on and that is at pottery barn so i didn't actually go in here specifically for these i was looking for something else so i actually got two of these one has a tea on it for me and the other one is for connor so i've actually seen these heaps i've just seen these everywhere i really like them i really like coffee so i do have a lot of mugs and yeah this one's just really cute and simple so i got this one and then connor has a matching one so yeah that is my boxing day haul on to the rest of the video <laughs> what the hell um i did just add in a bunch of clips that i took last night i didn't vlog at all at all and i'm sure you can tell by my voice by the color of my tongue it was a good night <laughs> so yeah a little bit not the freshest this morning but i've got powerade and i'm about to order a coffee so it's gonna be great i had the best night and i just literally was having so much fun i forgot to vlog um but i did add in a couple of zesty little clips for you guys so enjoy that um but yeah we went on the yacht club and it was just incredible best way to bring in the new year um i was like kind of keeping track of like the time and i was like oh it's 30 minutes away and then the dj was like it's in five minutes and i was like oh my god it's a new year i just get so weirded out like that's crazy i yeah i don't know i wanted to say like a little bit about it but 2020 was besides like the pandemic was literally like the one of the best one of the worst years ever so many amazing things came out of 2020 but also some really shit things so it was like the highest highs and the lowest lows and i am so excited for this new year obviously the pandemic isn't really gonna stop as of january 1st even though i feel like a lot of people think that but as of today it's still a problem you still need to stay stay safe um really 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 lucky to live here because it's pretty under control knock on wood um just really grateful for living here especially queensland we're doing just amazing but yeah i feel like a lot of people think that as january 
2021 comes around that the pandemic would just stop but sadly that's not the case it's still prevalent but nonetheless i'm still going to try to have the best year ever i'm so excited for this year it's crazy like what but yeah me and my power aid are gonna finish it up and i don't even know what the next clip will be yep <laughs> happy new year first starbucks of 2021 Anyways, hi, good morning, happy Saturday. Uh, oh my god, I'm feeling a lot fresher than yesterday, which probably isn't that hard. Um, don't mind that in the background. That's a situation. Our bed also still has not arrived, so it's literally just on the floor. Hopefully Monday, we will see. We are gonna forgive them because it is just a crazy time of year, and we did order it like a. I think like Christmas Eve. So yeah, we'll forgive them for that. If it comes Monday, that'll be so great. Sitting, not sitting, but sleeping on the floor is still very interesting. Um, luckily we still have a mattress. Um, nonetheless, today is Saturday, as I said. I'm all dressed, ready to go. Um, we're gonna go to Belly to go to Tarte. My mom hasn't been to Tarte and I love it. So I'm gonna take her there and show her one of my fave cafes. And yeah, I will follow them next. It's literally the cutest cafe. So yeah, that's literally all I kind of have planned today. It's just kind of, I don't know. That's, that's what I'm doing. So I will show you my outfit. I have a lot of pearls going on today i don't know it just kind of felt it so yeah i'll show you my outfit very very monochromatic all the way to the bottom don't really go monochromatic like black and white very often so kind of vibing it today um but it's pretty hot today so nice cool outfit <laughs> welcome back yeah it is now monday morning i suck at this um so apologies but i just like didn't really do too much interesting stuff yesterday so today is actually monday i'm pretty sure it's january 4th so today is officially the first day back at work so i'm coming to you live from my office i've just been picking up things kind of all morning why is the printer making that noise i've just kind of been picking bits up just so i can start this new year on a really good note and everything's nice and clean and ready so i actually have a couple of bits to organize before i dive into some emails and i've also got um something organizing that i want to show you guys but i'm just gonna pick up these bits and then i'm gonna make myself a coffee so i got up really early so i can start getting back into my routine and i'm so happy about that because i just love a good routine so i got up washed my hair dried it etc and now we're feeling good we've got some comfies on and we're ready almost ready to start the day i'm gonna do this bit and then make a coffee Woohoo! So pretty much what I'm doing is when I get clothing PR, I obviously have like, well, most of the time I have a time frame in which it needs to be up. And I also like to schedule out every post um, because I'm very like about it. <laughs> but yeah, I like to schedule out and I like to make sure I know what I have to wear readily available. So what I do is I hang everything up on my little clothing rack here and I will also sort them out into like how I wanna wear them like in the order. Um, and because everything's kind of dependent on like the weather and where you're going as well. So I just like to be able to see them. I just feel like it's the best way of doing it. And also it doesn't, it means like the clothes won't wrinkle or anything like that because they're hung up and then i also like to take them from the hanger in here and put them back in my wardrobe so it's just like a nice easy flow of things it's really organized and yeah i like it's so once it's worn I take it off the hanger come grab his hanger put it in my wardrobe if i want it hung up obviously and yeah 
organized like that i love it so i've actually got two bags like this one is full and then this pink one is also full of clothes so i'm gonna hang that up get them up on my clothing rack and get myself sorted i also obviously had to go buy a lot more hangers as well so the exact amount of hangers to get everything up how good is that okay so that is all done now i feel so much better everything is hung up and the floor is clear and now we're almost ready to start the day i'm so excited i'm gonna go about to go make a coffee but when i picked up the coat hangers from kmart i actually picked up something that i've been buying every year never from Kmart because I didn't realize that I sold them and I don't think they did until this year so that is something that I've been doing the same that I've been doing every year and I feel like I'm a pretty organized person not to toot my own horn but I feel like I'm pretty organized and I feel like this actually helps me keep on top of all the tasks that I've got on all the things I need to do um besides actually I write them I write all my stuff down every day like what I need to do um but this kind of helps me have like an overall view of what's coming up and what I'm doing just to stay as organized as I can so this is a family calendar um I don't obviously use it in a family sense um so it's kind of hard to explain if you've never seen one before but so this is so this is what it looks like here this is the one that's from Kmart and I think it's a pretty cute so pretty much I, the original idea is it all the days of the month are here and then you have different sections for different people so obviously like mom dad Toby and like what they've got on through the day but I categorize mine in like what I've got on so like I'll do like personal work let's say YouTube Instagram and like have it organized like that so I can see what's coming up what needs to happen and just like to keep myself organized so yeah i really like family calendars um this is my one from kiki k they just didn't have any cute ones this year so yeah i just went and sold one it came out i thought that was really cute and it was a little bit cheaper this is like the example on the back of how it's kind of like laid out this just helps me be like on top of things and i really like it so i thought i would share that with you guys if you were interested yeah on to coffee coffee is made and let's begin the day okay so talk about good timing oh my god i just got into my car literally just then and it's parked outside as it was about to rain it's like literally it started spitting as i got in the car what good timing i literally just went to get a coffee and i saw connor it was only 20 minutes um it's just a very quick catch up because yeah so coffee catch up 20 minutes then now i need to go oh by the way i suck at this um <laughs> it's afternoon now so i'm gonna go to my po box normally i don't go on a monday but it's been a while um since i've been because of christmas so let's go okay hello again back oh god back from the post office i actually just popped in to westfield super quick and i have another coffee so <laughs> i didn't actually mean to get another coffee but i actually i'm wearing white this is not a good idea can i actually from the store to the door of my car all the ice inside this has melted but i went into glory jeans because i needed more of my syrups and so, so i actually picked up two because i really wanted to try the vanilla one so i got the caramel sugar-free syrup and the vanilla sugar-free syrup and because i bought two of them they i don't know if it's a normal thing but i got a free coffee and i've never actually tried 
Um, their iced coffee before. I've only ever had their hot coffee, so let's try it. Pretty good. Pretty good. Let's go home. Hi. <laughs> Come here. What are you doing? Oh, you just get sick. Oh. My sweet guy. <laughs> mm. Having cuddles. <laughs> yeah. Oh, where are you going? Anyways, I'm back home now and I thought I would show you guys what I bought on the weekend. Did I say? I say it was Saturday. Maybe it was Saturday and Sunday. So I went to Cotton On. I have been looking for these for a while now. I went in there not expecting them to have these in my size because I've seen them everywhere. They were out of stock online. Um, but they ended up having my size in all of the colors that I wanted. So I was pretty happy. So I bought three of the same thing. So it is just these little shorts here. They are elasticated, which is Oh my god. Actually, it's so much more comfortable without the drawstring. So I got the white, I got this beautiful like pastel yellow, and I got the tan. I wanted like the nudie kind of like sand color, but they did not have that in a six. So that was annoying. Then I got something that I've been looking for for freaking ever and it was on sale. So I guess this is a boxing day haul. So it is the Tim Tam Peter Alexander pajamas i love tim tams so i had to get them and i love pajamas so this is what they look like here i will take them out of the box i'll try them on later the top so cute and these bottoms look freaking huge i asked because my other peter alexander pajamas fit so well and they're an extra extra small but they said that this is the smallest size that they sell this pack in so that was kind of weird um but yeah we'll forgive it um so i'm very excited to put them on later and then also from cotton on i picked up this it's i mean they sell it separately but it's a matching set and i will show you guys that now so yeah i also picked up this here so this is what i'm wearing today um again they sell them separately but it is like a matching set um, and yeah, I've actually been looking for this forever and they didn't actually have my size, so I ended up just buying the small anyway. And it's an oversized fit, so it doesn't really matter, but it's just raw hem on both and no drawstring and pockets. So yeah, that's what I got from Cotton On. And yeah, I've just merged my coffees together, so I'm gonna go drink that and get some more work done. Woo! Making Connor some French toast and putting the coffee on. Okay, so I've actually got some content to film today, but it is so, so, so hot. It is really, really hot today. So I'm just like waiting to the last minute to like put my clothes on properly because I'm that hot. See, I've got a whole fluffy set on. It's a super cute, but I'm waiting to like the very last minute to put my arms through this because it's so hot. It's just... Look, I'm all for saving the environment, but these paper straws suck. Like, surely there's a better alternative because I have a frozen and it just crumbles the straw. Like, it doesn't work. Surely they can do better than this. This is how hot it is. I desperately need a frozen. Good morning. Happy Wednesday. I've already had two coffees, so I'm feeling it. Um, I also haven't made my bed yet, so that makes me feel like shit. But I just got a package in the mail, so I thought I'd show you guys what was in it. Okay, so I did just have to quickly make my bed because that was just embarrassing and I also look rough. So yeah, let's just 
unbox this. Unbox. So first off, we have this little dress. It has little ties here and then it ties in the middle. Super cute. Oh, I've seen these everywhere and I've actually been wanting to try one. Um, so it's like this, the singlets that have the padded shoulders. So I'm pretty stoked to try that style out. This is all padding in here. So it actually like sits out a little bit more. So pretty excited about that one. Pretty sure this is a set. So it's a matching set. So this is the top here, followed by the matching skirt. Love that color. Lastly, we have this, which is a dress. It's actually, I'm pretty sure it's ruched, yeah. And I'm guessing this just ties in the middle here. Ah, yes. Oh my God, that's so cute. So yeah, there's that one there. These are all from Camille Boutique and these will all be on my Instagram. So make sure you go ahead and look at them and check them out because they have the cutest stuff. So thank you so much to Camille Boutique for sending me these. Um, I've had a couple of their bits before and I love it. So very excited to uh, try those ones on, get some really cute pics, but yeah, I should get ready for the day. Good morning. So I have been actually so busy this morning. So I literally haven't even had a coffee yet, but that's okay because I'm pretty sure Connor made me one which is so nice. Oh yeah. Also, this absolutely needed to be in a vlog. Woolworths now sell these. Oh my God. I cannot tell you how happy I am. If anyone's watching this from Europe, you're probably like, I don't get it. But they, oh my God, they don't sell these in Australia until now. So I am so happy. Oh my God. So first step, be ready. Fingers crossed. The next step is hippos because... But I'm so excited about this. It's the small things in life. Okay, so I'm back home now. I honestly feel like this vlog is all over the place because so I'm really sorry. I need to go have a shower and scrub my tan off because like this is not a mood. I don't even know how this happened. Um, so that's fun. But our bed arrived. Oh my God. I'm so happy. This has been so long awaited. But it is finally here and uh, it looks like a Connor job to me. So, um, yeah, I'm so glad that I can finish this vlog off by showing you guys what the new bed looks like because I feel like that's just not satisfying that I was telling you I was getting a new bed and it never came. So it has arrived and I'm so excited to see it. But now I need to go scrub this tan off. Um, I do want to put, actually, no because I had a meeting today that got canceled. Um, it's now moved to tomorrow and I was kind of planning on just doing my tan tomorrow. So now I'm gonna scrub this off now, give my skin a little bit of breathing time and time to like absorb my moisturizer and then I'm gonna put it on again tonight so I can look presentable for my meeting tomorrow. So I'm gonna go ahead and do that. Also, I had so many cute outfits planned with this little like rugby style top it's actually so cute but guess what it doesn't go with white shorts it just looks so weird but oh well it is what it is Okay, so I'm all showered now. Uh, actually, no, I already have my shower when I spoke to you guys last, but I've tanned now, so I'm just gonna wait for that to develop. I've just popped on um, Uber Stay just because I want, normally I do Uber Fast, I've been really loving that one, but considering the weather this weekend, I've decided to put Uber Stay on just to have it last a little bit longer because I literally cannot be bothered. But I also need it looking a little more crisp at the start of the week. So that's what I've gone for today and our bed is all set up and honestly we're not that happy with it. Oh now you can see the difference, oh my god. So this is it here, I think we're gonna have to get a new one because I mean this is all fine at the moment because at least we've got something to sleep on but we definitely want something 
with a much higher bed head. We thought it was going to come like up here where our last one did, but it's really, really small. So we're going to have to buy a new bed head part. The ensemble part should be fine. Um, so we'll just need to get a different one of those, which is so much fun, but that's okay. But I am going to leave the vlog here. So if you did like these videos, let me know because it was actually pretty fun filming every day. Um, sorry if it was really boring, but yeah. <laughs> so let me know if you do want to see more of these vlogs or if anything else you guys want to see. Let me know in the comments down below. But as usual, I'll have all my links down below so you can go check me out on Instagram. And yeah, thank you so much for watching this vlog and I will see you in my next video. Bye. Also, Happy New Year.